What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Child, we about to get into the baby um, <laughs> running off on a 20-piece. Let's get into it. I paid the baby $20,000, and he walked all set, bro. He walked all set, bro. I'm going to be real, bro. Like, I'm defeated, bro. Like, I don't know how long I could do this, shit, bro. First of all, my boy, you better learn to get some paperwork. One thing the baby going to do is run off, but he already told you that. You know, nigga said, hit a lick and make a bad day a good day. He ain't even pop it open. He a good play. Around with a nigga get remixed. <laughs> nigga say he be at the dinner eating good steak. You knew if your paperwork wasn't right, this boy was going to run off with the cash. But not only that, I think the only reason why he ran off Cause it was a disco ball pants wearing ass who um, pissed him off basically. But I think the baby felt like he was in a situation where he might have had to get a nigga up out of here. And he wasn't about to, you know, go through this media again. That's why I'm at with it. But you know, we could continue, Chad. <laughs> My grandma gave me ten thousand dollars out of the twenty thousand, bro. Because she wanted to see this video before she go, bro. She battling cancer right now, bro. Like, and I did this for her, bro. That's, that's, uh, disco ball pants wearing that right there. My great grandma, bro. Like. It might have been a possibility that his grandma gave him that 10K. Hear me out. If grandma gave him 10K, and you know, when you get old and you about to die, you ain't thinking about too many things. But, you know, let me make my people happy before I go. But I ain't gonna, I, I wouldn't have took that 10,000 home, granny. But he 19, it's a different, it's a different mindset. So, you know, whatever. I'm at a loss for words, bro. Can y'all please tag the baby and tell him, please run this video back, bro. Please run a video back, bro. I put my all into this YouTube, bro. I'm 19, bro. I'm from New Orleans, Louisiana, bro. A lot of people don't make it to this position, bro. Please. He got to understand niggas don't be giving a damn about that crying. He really, really cry a lot when he get in these situations that he put himself in. First of all, you got to have your paperwork together when you step into any nigga that already got money. Because if you don't, they going to run off. That's number one. Number two, is it right for the baby to run off? No, but we don't know what situation he was put in that he felt as though he needed to go. You know what I'm saying? Um, it is um, a couple videos that I will react to that had something to do with the situation. But like, bro... I'm not about to, uh, you know, throw my everything away because you want to let a little nigga play with me. It's not happening. But he got to stop sounding so soft when when he take an L. At some point, he got to realize he took the L because he never he never speak about his accountability in the situation. This is the same guy who um, dealt with the same thing with Krishan. And it's like, bro, you did this to yourself. I ain't even care. You did this. To yourself. Now, this is the old dude that had something to do with it. Silver pants. Damn, G. They told me to ask that question. Why don't you suck the fuck out of it? They told me to ask that question. You with this? Yeah, we got that look. You with this? It's what I do. I'm professional now. Fart sucker. Professional fart sucker. <laughs> <laughs> Fast so he got mad that the baby snatched his phone. That's what happened. And kicked me out the, the baby's off body because the baby felt plead because I because he made a comment about sucking fart out of and I said you're a prof sucker, fart sucker, and he felt plead. I would too because nigga leave me alone. And he was trying to say I'm I'm being professional. He was trying to be nice. Uh, that's how I feel about the situation. Y'all let me know what y'all think, but child, <clears throat> this was the baby response. Well, first of all, the baby said he didn't run off. He walked off. That's what he said. I ain't got no business. Look, look at the type of look I would just. This ain't even the one. Hold on. Let me find y'all the full video. Child, I was sure looking at it last night. Well, in and out of looking at it because... I had a lot to do, but yeah, let me, let me find it. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. 
He said you could have went viral the right way. Hold on, let me make sure it look good on my short. He said you could have went viral the right way posting a video of me pressing your partner W them big ass silver shorts on. <laughs> I guess he was saying with them big ass shorts on. That's the type of people want to see, kid. Quit lying on, on your granny and let these folks know your entourage effed your bag up. Need your ass whoop playing on your grandma's name, boy. Where your morals at, kid? And then he said he had an idea. Go to idea, go to idea, young nigga. Because I'm feeling good tonight. I'm on some other shit. See what I'm saying? I was on some other shit the other night, too. That's why I just, I just left peacefully. I said, hmm, this is preposterous. I'm out of here. Oh, God. <laughs> but since, you know, you getting on here and you, you making your little story up and all that, and, and now you, you, got, you got people playing with my name, like I just came and just robbed you, check this, this is what we going to do. I'm going to take the $20,000 that you gave me for my time for that hour plus that I spent in up. $20,000. Hour plus. And I'm going to give $1,000 a piece to them 20 girls that you paid to let a lame nigga like you disrespect them, you know what I'm saying, for that little YouTube check. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get that 20000 that you gave me. I'm going to give it to them girls, them queens, you know what I'm saying, because they don't need to be having no lame ass nigga like you. Play with them, know it. Okay. But you... <laughs> <clears throat> Boy, Boy, you do. <laughs> it's over with. It's I'm sorry. It's funny because what? Listen, this is this is the reality of it. The baby knew that nigga ain't have good paperwork on him. I'm telling y'all right now. That's exactly how it went. He knew he did not have good paperwork on him, and he said, "All right, this is a situation. I'm gonna have to head on out. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna have to get out of this." <clears throat> Cause boy, I'm gonna have to put somebody up again. Who the fuck got time for that? I know I wouldn't. God knows, I wouldn't have time for that. Done. That's day money. That's them queens money, nigga. Yo, it ain't twenty verse me no more. It's twenty verse you, nigga. <laughs> you do. <laughs> and I'm telling you too. I I was just talking to my partner Rico when I left from them the other night. That's we we sat outside the hotel, talked for a little minute, like. I ain't got no business even, you see what I'm saying? It eases that, that, quick that. Little, Shouldn't even that, that quick little 20 ball is to pick up. I ain't got no business. Look, look at the type of little nigga I was just in there dealing with. This little nigga, you, you're lying on your grandma. <laughs> you're playing. You, you, you sick. You a sick little dude. You a sick little dude. <laughs> he... He said, uh, LaMike said he was going to basically prove that he wasn't lying <clears throat> about the like I said, situation. But he's still not getting that money back. The way people believe in that little story you made up, I can only imagine. People probably be believing this 20 verse 1 shit. Like, this shit for real. Like, you don't be paying these girls to do this. So, so this, this we going to do. <laughs> Case closed. Ain't got nothing more to say about it. You believe a nigga that play on his grandma, that's on you. And whatever niggas want to do, let me know so I can speed it up. Ladies who was ladies who was there, tap in. We're going to split this 20K and leave this, this lying-ass nigga where he at. And when I catch your sneaky ass, I'm going to show you some love so you know how much I care about you. I don't know what he was what he was talking about that. Right playing wrong person, uh, LaMike Jr. Keep hustling, boy. <clears throat> And girl, that was that on that. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Comment section below. Lesson learned. Do never give a nigga the back end before the show start. Most clubs do, but on the end of 20v1, I will go ahead and put that in the contract. Because ultimately, the most he can say is no. And then you lucky that he said no, because who the hell got time for that? But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.